this of any use? It's, it's a diving helmet, obviously. Will this really let us breathe underwater? Well, okay, the old time diving helmets, I mean, sure they worked, but it required a thick hose that you couldn't get any kinks in. And like two people on shore that had to manually pump the oxygen inside. Let's go! And apparently you don't need any of that for this magical diving helmet. Currents fast. No kidding. But unless we hop in, we won't see our friends again. Wait, our friends? What do you mean, our friends? The Elvis is the only one that knows him, right? Kanicho and uh, and Tweak, they don't know any of these people, do they? They don't know anything about Coco or, or Glenn or Luke or anything like that. Let's-a go! Wait, there was only the one diving helmet! How did... What? How are all three of them going in? Do they all fit into the same helmet? How big was this helmet? And now we are going through the Serpent Trench uh, with our one diving helmet for the three people. Now in this you have pretty much two options of where you can go, but first you have fights against new enemies. And this will give me a chance to show off the rage a little bit. We're going to go with Hazer here. I don't know if you guys remember the Hazer, but the Hazer actually had Bolt 2. Uh, which is exactly what we want. Uh, Tweak is still floating. You could use the bolt two that I that I was telling everybody about instead of just doing a normal attack. He's still floating from a previous rage that I gave him. I think uh, Terra Dawn is the one that I gave him. And that one, uh, if you remember, they were the the flying pterodactyl looking things. And he still refuses to show off bolt two. So we're just going to finish this guy off with just our standard. <laughs> and we're going to move on. Now we are going to be presented with a couple options here. If I remember correctly, after this one fight, left or right, I choose right. Because right always leads to treasure. Left leads to more monsters, in case you would like that. Oh, super. Okay, uh, this one. Uh, kill this guy with normal attacks. If you can, first. Uh, anything other than normal attacks. And he will destroy you. There's no other way to put it. He will destroy you. As a result, I'm not letting Tweak really attack yet. Which does mean that we are kind of getting our asses handed to us right now but finally they are dead so let's do hazer again hopefully he can do a bolt too holy crap <laughs> there's bolt too is it multi-attack it is multi-targeting kills everything just fine i will probably need to heal him somewhere along the line there but if you attack that other thing with anything other than a regular attack uh it will kill you with um i forget the, the name of the attack but it, it is nasty I do need to heal, though. All healed and ready to move on. If we head over to the right here, we can get an X potion. Uh, I would always prefer the right path here, uh, even though, you know, technically you could go left and get more fights, which could help you get more rages down the line. I would say always go right and go right here because once again, this leads to treasure, left leads to monsters. I prefer the treasure. Same enemies as before. Those enemies have Aqua Rake. Awesome. We might remember those from Final Fantasy V. Aqua Rake is, is not good for me. But we have found ourselves another cave, so let's head inside. And I don't think there are random encounters in here, but there should be a way to that treasure chest. I want that treasure chest. Hold on. I think it's through here. Yeah, okay, this is, this is just more than one room. I thought it was just that one room for a second there. Is this a recovery spring? No, of course not. That'd be too nice. Too nice. Everybody's at about half HP. Uh, but we should be fine. We, we should be fine. <laughs> so let's head down here. 
and we can get this treasure chest finally, which has a green beret in it, which is not bad, except that because I did grind in the vault a bit, I already have three, so I'm good. We'll finally head out here, though, and it should lead us further on. No random encounters in here, which is very nice. Uh, nice, for, nice for a break. We, uh, this has been quite a long scenario, I must say. And we're back out in the Serpent Trench. And it doesn't look like there are going to be any more battles this time. We're just going to make it all the way to the town. You remember that the guy in Mobilis told us that the Serpent Trench would lead us to this town. And once again, Elvis and Water don't seem to get along very well. But we have made it to the next town, which is always nice. I think there is stuff for us to do down here. I could be mistaken. There is this guy. How you doing, buddy? Uh, I still need to shop. This will take us to South Figaro, which is obviously the place that we want to go eventually. But first, we have this town to explore. This is uh, Nikea. That's how I'm going to say it. Like, uh, just do it and destroy your family while trying to make a table or something. Right in between those two. Nikea. The odd man lives near the Leet River. His wife bore him a son. What? The woman passed away. The man totally lost it. He thought the newborn was a monster. I wonder what happened to the poor little boy. Can I move Tweak up to the front here? Do, does, does this change anything? It probably doesn't. No, it doesn't. It was a good idea, though. No, you're staying... Damn it. <laughs> there. That is what I wanted. Back to normal. Jeez. <laughs> what? Yoo-hoo, you handsome thing. How about joining me, Tiki? Oh, and of course, she wants the mustache. How dare you, you licentious howler. Jeez, don't blow an artery, baby. Oh, damn. <laughs> baby. Kanijo, don't let it get to you. I'm not like that. No one thinks you are. Just let it go. Stop whispering. My ears are burning, baby. Enough. Have you no shame? I'll have you know. Goodness. Oh, you gotta love that scene. Uh, how you doing, buddy? Zen, Albrook, Miranda, they've all been smashed. That doesn't sound good at all. Nothing else I can really do here, though. And to be honest, I don't think there is much to do in this town. How you doing, little kid? Yes, you are a loser. You're obligated to buy from me. What do you have? Uh, nothing of that much consequence. The only thing that I could really see myself purchasing are more white capes, but... Nah, I'm good. I'm good. That's the relic shop, though. Freaking kid, 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 kid. Yeah, nobody can reach here unless they have a ship. I did because I have a helmet. Here's the armor shop. Nothing that I really need here, uh, but I'll purchase a, a couple. Whoa, not that many. Two silk robes. That should be good. Why two? You only have one character that can equip it. Shut up. Voice in my head. That's all that I want here. I'm in the way. How dare you? Uh, now we can go here and we can look at the items. He doesn't really have anything new. Do I need anything? I think I'm good. I think I'm good. You know, I'm considering Phoenix Downs, but, you know, five. Five should last me for a bit. And then over here we can find the needle shop. I mean the weapon shop. It looks like a needle to me for whatever reason. Uh, we can purchase a mithril claw, which is what Elvis has equipped. But yeah, I don't. I don't really want to make him a Genji glove user so that they can both use it. Uh, to be honest, Kon Konijo would be the better option for that anyway. And ugh, mithril pike. I already have one. And, uh, you know, I'm not really using it. For, I'm not using Glenn for, you know, phys regular physical attacks anyway. 
So let's just move on. How you doing, buddy? Yes, it does look like junk, but... And then he never finishes it. Uh, nothing more over here. There is one thing that I do want to grab. I think I talked to everybody here. Ah, here are the stairs. Uh, this leads to the inn. And in the inn, there should be... Where is it? I swore it was in the inn. Ah, I can go over through here. Okay, there we go. In here, there's another grandfather clock, and just like every other grandfather clock, it has an elixir in it. I don't know why. I don't know why. And that is actually it for the town, I believe. We need to talk to you. Uh, we can't lead. We can't go north because the pack is blocked, and I don't think there's you know any hidden items here. So, can I leave and then come back in? Where will it spawn me? Uh, there's really nowhere for us to go because, like they said, the path is blocked, and that's not the way that we wanted to go anyway. Oh, so it does just lead me back to that same entrance. Um, where we want to go now is back to South Figaro. Of course, we're still headed for Narj. That is our ultimate destination. And you remember that South Figaro was relatively close to Narsh. <laughs> From what I remember, it could... Uh, is it Narsh? could be Narshi. I've never known. I've never known how to pronounce that damn place. Alright, so let's get on board the ship. I don't really need to do any... Oh, wait, there's more down here? Uh, probably not. No. No, nothing down here of consequence. So, hold on for one second, though. Okay, now we are ready to go. So, let's head up here and talk to the shopkeep. I mean, captain of the ship. Uh, yes, we are ready to head to South Figaro. And if you guys remember, South Figaro did have direct access to Narsh, so South Figaro pretty much means that we are there back to Narsh. Narsh is just a stone's throw away. Why is Kanicho so excited to get to Narsh? Is it just for revenge on the Empire with the Returners? I don't know. I hope the others arrived safely. Once again, Elvis should be the only one that knows these people. I'm sure they did. Kanijo really only knows Elvis, Bash, and Tweak. Me hope so too. And Tweak knows nobody, but he's he's just kind of naive and innocent like that. Kind of like a kid. Choose a scenario, and luckily I have already unequipped everybody from all their equipment. I wonder which scenario I'm going to pick next, but this epic cliffhanger will have to wait until next time. That's going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. I have been Baller Scoop. I've been joined, as always, by uh, Mog and Luke. They were totally here the whole time. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.